The graduation of the Foreign Service Training Program was held last night at the Laguna Hotel in Port Moresby. Guests included ministers of cabinet, members of the diplomatic corps, and invited guests. Director of the training program, Peter Eafiare, said the program is an initiative of the government of New Zealand and Papua New Guinea, administered through the Victorian University of Wellington and the PNG Department of Foreign Affairs. The primary objective of the Foreign Service Training Program is to help build capacity. To the graduates, I have, to, I have had the greatest pleasure of helping mentor you through the last nine months. I certainly hope you remember your P's and Q's, your comportment, and most importantly, you remember who you are representing each time you open your mouth to speak. The training is an interactive program conducted by facilitators for three initial weeks at the Victorian University of Wellington in New Zealand. Minister Rimbing Pato said that as PNG faces new and emerging social, political and economic opportunities from globalization, it's important for the Foreign Service to build PNG's connections and partnerships for the betterment of the country. The Foreign Service is the ears and the eyes of our country. It is our responsibilities to establish those elements of globalization. Professor Winnie Laban, Assistant Vice Chancellor of the Pacific Studies, said globalization is not a new concept to the Pacific region. The whole legacy of collectivity in the region started a long, long time ago with our ancestors. My great great grandfather was one of the first two Samoan missionaries that came to Papua New Guinea, and he's buried here. So one of the ex-prime ministers of Papua New Guinea said, Winnie, your bones are here. So when people talk about globalisation, the Pacific people have been doing it since day one. I have this firm conviction that it's Papua New Guinea that has the resources, it has the energy and the drive. And I have, when I have been talking to the trainees in this programme to point out that Papua New Guinea has a leadership role. Secretary for Foreign Affairs William Dim said PNG is not only preparing for some important upcoming events like the Pacific Games and the Pacific Islands Forum, but also looking more widely and further ahead. To play a proactive part and ensure that government policies are implemented and Papua New Guinea's national interests are protected and promoted in a rapidly changing regional and global environment. Mr. Dim said the recently reactivated Foreign Service Training Program makes up for lost opportunities in the past and helps build the human capacity for the department and PNG's missions and posts. Deli Waigeno, National MTV News.